We now return to Let's Play Bombita. The jungle level. And now it's telling me I've got a new power. I don't know what this jungle is doing outside of the school. Oh shoot. Um... Shoot. No! trying to get over it. This is not the right ending. So now I have to use this to follow the smell to the proper ending. Moving on. Should probably use this to find out where I'm going. What's this? I picked up something. Sorry, Birdie. Not today. Okay, extended my life a little bit. I can only see these poison clouds when I'm using this ability.
Now I have to wait for it again. I'm sure there was a secret down there I just passed, but oh well. I'm not going for a hundred percent complete in a game I can't read. Wait a minute. Alright, now comes the hard part. I've had to replay the second world a couple times because of this last boss. <clears throat> In fact, I'm going to save state here. Because this one is a little bit complicated. It's a mini game boss. So it's basically the Japanese version of red light, green light. You have to crawl forward when he's doing that and by hitting A. Then when he stops, I have to pick a pose using the directional pad. If he sees me, he'll beat me up. And then when I get to him, this is the part that really screwed me over, because I just glossed over this and I didn't read it. But, uh, I have to use the Dokonjo Dryer, which I guess is blowing into the mic. And because it's an emulator, I can't do that. Fortunately, there's a key that uh, I can keybind to do that for me. And then, after I've done all that, we have to run away from him. I'm going to save again real quick. And let the aggravation begin. This is actually tense. Fortunately, the other guy is screwed up. So that'll give me basically a free turn to get ahead of him. I'm gonna save. This is worth another save.
And another one. I did it. No! At least it didn't make me do it all over again. There we go. Just a little interesting fact, the, uh, Mr. Z, or Zed, because the rest of the world calls it Zed. Um, interesting fact, that little, uh, game we just played is a real game that, uh, kids play, and the phrasing is... Daruma-san... Well, I forget. But anyway, it means... I think it means Daruma... fell over. And if you don't know, Daruma is like a... Is he a Buddhist? Like, he's a Bodhisattva or something? I don't know. Anyway. Uh, he has no arms and no legs. And... He is blind, and if you're ever in Japan, you've probably seen the little red, round guys, <laughs> and those are Daruma dolls. And uh, when you have one, you're supposed to fill in one of his eyes, make a wish, and then when that wish comes true, you fill in the other eye. But anyway, what he was saying was Akuma. Uh, uh, Koronda or something like that. Anyway, basically I think it meant a bear killed. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway, continuing next time. <laughs>